Welcome to Takeaways. This week we're at the historic Miss Florence Diner. It opened up back in 1941. It was opened by Maurice and Pauline Alexander and has been a big part of Northampton and Florence uh, cuisine ever since. Let's go. When we first open the restaurant in the morning, we do a lot of prep work. So we cook off home fries, we cook off bacon, we get basically all the foods hot that are gonna be served, you know, first thing. Make coffee, obviously. Clean up, set up for the day, unlock the doors, and make sure we have the newspaper. Okay, so Miss Flo's is unique in this area based on the fact that we're 81 years old. We're listed on the National Historic Register of famous and historical places, and We've been in continuous operations since 1941. Welcome back to Takeaways. Um, today we are at Florence Diner, Miss Florence Diner. What would you rate the appearance out of 10? Appearance? This looks like a nine. This looks really good. It and looks I'm money. I'm really hungry and I'm really excited to take a bite into this. It looks simple, but like really tasty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think mine is like, I'd say like a seven, eight out of 10. It's definitely like a little messy, but you know, quesadillas aren't supposed to be like necessarily fine dining. There's a lot of ingredients in here, but it looks tasty. I say we just dig in. Yes. Let's go. We also have um, specialty sodas that they actually make here at the diner. I got a raspberry lime soda. It's delicious. I got an orange cream soda. It's really good. Not many restaurants, or like no restaurants, I don't think, make any of their own soda on site and then serve it. I was very surprised to see it here. It's very cool, it's very interesting, interesting factoid. And it's good. Yeah. Taste, out of 10, what are you thinking? Um, for taste, again, I think I'm giving it the same score as appearance. It looks as good as it, good as it is. It's a nine. Shout out Aiden's mom for actually buying us the food, but Shout out, Mom. This has been really good. Mm. I think, honestly, price overall, around 11 bucks for the quesadilla, plus a couple bucks for the soda. I'd say it's an eight, nine out of 10. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for all the unwavering support we've gotten. Um, thank you, Aiden's mom. Thank you, Rory. Thank you, Parker, for helping on the cameras. Thank you, random guy in truck that gave us some random factoids about the restaurant. Shout out Aiden's mom again. Um, and we'll catch you next week.